staff wise, uh, you know, at this point, don't anticipate uh, any other major changes. Um, uh, we'll have uh, a couple new titles, a couple new things uh, with guys, but I don't, I don't anticipate anything, um, you know, any other changes at this point. Although we always know that's a that's a possibility in our world. So uh, excited about the staff we have. Uh, you know, obviously the full time guys, and and I don't think that. You know, we're continuing to grow and, and improve together as a staff, and I and I think the continuity here has been so important. I think it's been key to any of the successes we have had, and I think it's important going forward as much as you can. Uh, you know, now if a guy gets a great opportunity to to go be a head coach or to go take a major step up, then you're always happy for him. Uh, but I think us being able to to have the continuity we've have has again been critical, and not only with our our full time staff, but also our our, our young coaches, uh, because those guys, you know, our, our quality controls, our, our GAs do such a tremendous job and they're valuable assets. And, and you know, we're going to be able to welcome back that group as a whole as well, which I'm very excited about. I, I think as top to bottom, it's it's probably the, the top, uh, you know, quality control GA staff that, that we've had. And uh, these guys really make a big impact. Um, you know, Ty Darlington, Eric Rand, Connor McQueen on the offensive side, Parker Henry, uh, Will Johnson, Austin Woods on the defensive side, and then Ryan Doherty, uh, special teams, who you know jumped in for Coach Beamer a few times last year. Uh, those guys have been outstanding, and they're all they're all you know going to be great great coaches, and are going to get some big time opportunities here pretty quickly. But we're excited to have all those guys back and a part of our team once again.